Hey everybody, it's Adam, and if you know me, if you knew me personally, you'd know that I'm actually kind of addicted to getting packages. Um, about five or six show up every single day. I'm so addicted to getting packages that if I'm somewhere that's not my house or my shop and I see a FedEx truck, even in another city, I secretly hope they have a package for me. That's the pathology here. Well, the FedEx truck just left and they did have an actual package for me and this one is from Prop Store of London. Yeah, there's a costume in these two boxes and I'm going to unbox it for you now. Oh, here we go, are you ready? Here we go. Let's see. Ah, here we go. Oh yeah. Always with the peanuts. Always with the peanuts. Ooh, here we are. All right. This is gonna be so awesome. Okay, here we go. Uh, the first part is this, which is a shield. Yes, this is armor that I'm unwrapping. You know how much I love armor. And this shield is from a movie. Go. Let's see here. How, oh, that's it. Look at that. Look at that. That is beautiful. Look, there's a, yeah. That's gorgeous. It looks really old, but it's light. It's plastic. Oh, that is fabulous. Okay, you, you stay there. Oh. So pretty, look at that. That is gorgeous and I'm here to tell you, this, while it looks like brass, hammered brass, is in fact a plastic. Oh my gosh, this is great. Look at that, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right. Is it starting to become clearer? It is Thracian in origin. What, Thracian armor? There's a couple things you can count on from prop store, besides costumes and props. The biggest Ziploc bags you've ever encountered and tons of peanuts. I love these big Ziploc bags. I know, I know you can get them from Uline. I heard you. Uh, let's see here. So this is, this is, oh, this is like a tunic of some kind. Oh, look, and it's got some design in there and everything. Let's see. Is there a front and back? There was no front and back back in the oldie times. Oh, 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 oh okay. Oh, there's so many things. Two of six, that's a hard part. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, there's some weaponry. Oh, this is gonna be good. This is like, this sort of like, what could be in here and how cool is it gonna be is like what I wished for from every Christmas morning. I'm reliving it every time the FedEx person leaves. Okay, so now this will become my table. Awesome. Look at that. Look. Look how beautiful that is. Holy cow. Ah. Oh, I just got to tell you, when you purchase something that has been weathered and aged by a movie uh, 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 prop department, it's just going to be inherently more amazing, more cool, more far out. Yeah. Okay. So we've got some sort of girdle in here. Sorry about my microphone. Hey, Simone. I want to help attach this. And there's uh, some, see Your how book. this is done here and see how that's done there? Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay, wait. Oh, I see. Yeah, it sews me up. Yeah, it's like a little crisscrossing mm -hmm. thing in my bobber. 
Just a little, yeah, yeah little it's bow. A little thing. Brilliant. Thank you. Oh, yeah. This looks like um, some skirt material. Oh, that goes underneath this. Wow, right. So there's probably... <laughs> this is, I can't even tell you, like, it looks like it's heavy duty, but it's super comfortable to wear. Yeah, look at that. Some gauntlets. The, um, okay. You should check out this attention to detail. This is, uh, this is simply plastic, but it's been leafed and painted in a way to look like formed leather. It is really, really, really lovely. There's those two pieces, and then there is these two pieces. What are these? Oh, these are probably shins. Yes. With elastic even. Wow. Okay, so let's see if I can even put these on. Doing this with blue jeans, man. Yep. I am not flexible enough. Okay. We're going to take it on faith that those are my shins. <laughs> Right? Yeah, okay, so those are the shins. These are my van braces. Yeah. Oh, maybe I should take the watch off. It's not really period correct. Beauty. Look at that. That's great. Okay, so these are the shins. Those live there. What is this? This has got to be a, a weapon of some kind. Go through a lot of muslin there at the prop store, don't they? Ooh. Oh. It looks like a, uh, a gladius of some kind. A sword. Oh, yeah. Look at that. With leather fittings and everything. It's been hand sewn. What a gorgeous attention to detail. Um, okay, we are almost there. Look at that. That is a lovely piece. That is an aluminum blade. Oh, so it is. It's an aluminum blade. It looks great. It's super lightweight. Yup. And then this probably, how would this go? Sure, sure, why not? That would appear, oh! It has busted a little bit. Oh, I see. It's got some electrical tape that repaired it from a problem it had. This is great. It's a movie spear. So let's uh, repair it in the same way that they did on set, clearly, with a little electrical tape. I can fix that with a little epoxy later. This is great. It's a, um, this is a hard rubber spear tip. Uh, it looks, I mean, even right up close, this looks absolutely like it is an ancient piece of material. I'm ready to complete the costume. Are you ready? You are. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, I am now officially... Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, this is beautiful! I am a Thracian warrior from the Rocks movie Hercules! Dude. I gotta tell you, this is a magnificent piece of both costume engineering and scenic painting and weathering and also comfortable for the actor. Um, I wanna give a shout out to the maker of this armor and I can tell you that this is, they've actually signed their work in here. Um, I-V-R-K-S-H-P, I workshop and it is, their address is www.wrkshp.me. Um, they clearly did a bunch of the costumes for Hercules, and they did a magnificent job. Whoa! See that? Look at that. It's been a while since I fought with the Thracians, but I still remember some of them. <laughs>